Hi there, um, Christine Campbell, author here. Um, now, I thought I would just make a little video today, really talking about things that we're not comfortable doing. Now, there's a lot of things I'm not comfortable doing. I'm sure you're the same. There's a lot of things that I don't feel I'm very good at doing. Perhaps you're the same. And one of the things for me that is or can be a bit of a problem is marketing my books. I'm an author. I would like to think it's not just a hobby. I would love to make a living at it. That's a very long way off. I don't know if you're aware that when you publish a book, the author gets a very small percentage of the cost of the book because the publisher, the Amazon, they all take their chunk. So I'd have to sell an awful lot of books to make a living. And I don't think I ever will, but I would like to have a go at at least covering my costs. So, with that in mind, I'm appealing to all of you out there who've read my books to perhaps think about writing a review because it's reviews that get Amazon putting you up their list so that they put you before other readers. So, and when, other, when people are looking for a book to read, they often check the reviews and if you've not got any or you've not got very many, they perhaps think it, the book's not worth reading. But what I've found in my experience is that lots of you out there tell me how much you've enjoyed my books. And that's lovely. And it's precious to me. Some of you have even written to me and emails or, or cards and told me how much you love my books. But often you're a little bit shy about actually telling me in, an, in a review on Amazon. So, I'm not very good at pushing for this, but here I am, I'm putting myself out there, it's something I don't do very often, and I'm asking for a favour. I'm asking if any of you have read my books to please write a review, and for those who have not, well, you might like to try them, particularly if you read the reviews. Now, if you are not, don't feel very good about writing reviews, if you don't know what to write, um, I have a few things here to think about. It was in a blog that I'll give you the link to the blog in a minute, uh, probably underneath. Um, a blog by Sally Cronin on her blog, Smorgasbord. And it was about reviews and uh, how important they are to writers and just encouraging readers how to write reviews, a good review, a worthwhile review. So here we go. I'll just read you some of the questions she suggested that you could answer and I'll put this down below as I say with the blog post and you can uh, have another look at it but she's suggesting that what will really help me in my future writing is to know some of the following in your review so first of all what did you like or dislike about the style of writing now I know that my writing is not going to appeal to everybody I'm perhaps got a very narrow audience with being contemporary women's fiction there are lots of people who read books, lots of women who read books, lots of women who read contemporary women's fiction. So, yeah, maybe not too narrow a genre. So, what did you like or dislike about the actual style of writing? What did you enjoy about the plots or the stories of the novel? You know, what, what was it that appealed to you or that held you? How did you feel about the main characters and were they believable? Was there a particular episode in the novel that you specifically enjoyed? What were your feelings when you finished the book? Were you satisfied? Wanted more? Or unsatisfied? Is there anything else that you feel is important to mention for the benefit of other readers? Did you like the cover and how the book was laid out inside? Was it easy to read? Would you recommend the book to others? Now, I think you'll agree. There's some good questions there and they could help you to find a way to write a review that wouldn't maybe um, be too difficult for you to do and you'd maybe feel comfortable doing. So that's my appeal. Thank you very much for listening to me and watching me and oh, I just, it would be lovely if some of you out there would look back over the books that you've read of mine and think about them 
and just answer some of those questions perhaps in a review on Amazon because I'm going to make a little bit more effort in the marketing area so that I can get a little bit more of the joy of, of sharing my work with other people. So that's what it's about for me, just sharing my, my work. And if you've enjoyed my books, well, maybe you could help me get them in front of other readers who might enjoy them too. So that's all for now. Hope you don't mind me posting this. See you soon. Bye. If I can turn it off.